Oh, hello there. <laughs> Didn't see you there. <laughs> Kidding. No, this is behind the scenes of Idaho State of Mind or for a broadcast production class. Either way, the information in this video is something you're going to need to know. My name is Chris Cole. Today we're going to be talking about how to use the Video Edit Lab. This is important to remember throughout your broadcast education. Pay attention. The Video Editing Lab is located in Room 113 in the James Rogers Department of Mass Communication in the basement of the Little Arts Building on the campus of Idaho State University in the city of Pocatello, located in Banana County in the state of Idaho in the United States of America on planet Earth. In case you didn't know. First things first, how to get into the lab. Now, Tom changes the code on the lock, so you need to ask him if it's changed from last semester. Get the code from Tom, and then you can access the editing lab. You'll need to use the locker type of lock to get the key on the inside of the lock. Once that is done, you can unlock the door. The door will remain locked no matter which way you turn the key. Once you get the door open, return the key to the lock on the door. Not in a second, not in a few minutes, not as soon as you're done. IMMEDIATELY! That way, other students can access other rooms without issue. Moving on. The Edit Lab includes, but is not limited to, seven computers, 12 monitors, one sound booth, 30 power outlets, a clock, an exit sign, a whiteboard, a projector screen, and f fuzzy walls. Side effects may include lack of sleep, crabbiness, hunger pains, uncontrollable crying, insanity, deafness, and seizures. Talk to your advisor to see if Edit Lab is right for you. Anyway, there are several postings around the Edit Lab. Some are inspirational, some are informative, and others are downright weird. Yeah. See that? You want to read the important announcements first. This one is important. So is this one. And this one. These three are the main rules of the edit lab. When Tom says no drink, he specifically means you can have many different types of drinks as long as you keep them on the desk by the door, but no alcohol. Found that out the hard way too. Yeah. Again, moving on. If you do want to take a break, step to the door, away from the expensive equipment, and enjoy your favorite beverage from the doorway. Psst. Hey, here's a secret. If Tom's not in the building, this rule becomes more of a guideline anyway. Just make sure there's no one to narc on you once you've done it. <laughs> gotcha, Tom. Okay, so we're going to skip over the major stuff because it takes too long. And it's boring. Sorry, Tom, it is. So, you're done in the edit lab. What to do? First... Make sure you put away all the equipment you used in the lab. Shut off the lights and close the door behind you. Make sure the door is locked. That's it. You're done. Now you know the basics of how to use the video edit lab. Remember the basics well because they'll serve you well in the future when you remember the more complex stuff. Or forget. Or remember. I'm not... I forgot which. We'll see you next time. This has been a Chris Cole production. Any use thereof is restricted to Tom Halak or the, to the current broadcast professor. I mean, Tom's not going to be around forever, so who can really say that the video dies with him? I mean, not that he's going to die. I mean, I mean he is, but I, I, we all... I'm done.